How did you mount that there? Oh, Velcro. Or magnet. magnet. Nice. Magnet. So it's really nice because I can just take it right out, take it home, nice. update maps, whatever I need to do, take it right off while I'm flying, if my autopilot's flying for me. Yeah. <laughs> they yeah. work good, eh, your autopilot? She's yeah. great. Yeah, it's always <laughs> activated. Yeah. Woodstock traffic, ultralight India, Mike Echo Mike positioning 3-1 for departure, Woodstock. Oh, you should probably say hi to YouTube. Say hi, hi YouTube. YouTube. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> you do, do you do your YouTube still? Or just no, Twitch No, it's now? been a while. Just Twitch? Yeah, pretty much just you'll, ha now. you'll have to tell everybody about your Twitch. Sure. But not right now. We'll wait till <laughs> we're flying. This is the boring part. Wait till it looks exciting. Yeah. Woodstock traffic, Mike Echo Mike, departing runway 31, right hand departure, climbing to 1500, Woodstock. Ready? Yep. Give her. <laughs> That's crazy. Wow. <laughs> I like that visibility too. It's, it's a lot better. Door too, so you can lean out and look yep. straight down, which is really nice. It's a whole different plane there. It's a whole different plane, <laughs> isn't it? But you were just up in the 150. Yeah. How is the wind in the 150 compared to this? Well, it felt. Is it, it, is it similar? It, well, it felt more, but it might be. Uh, it felt stronger, but it I mean. It felt stronger than the 150? Yeah. Interesting. I always figured the 150 would be a little better at it because it's heavier. Okay, yeah. But, I mean, we have much shorter wings than the 150, so there's oh. less wing to get hit by the air, different sure. air yep. winds and stuff. I don't know. Less I'm not surface a scientist. area, I guess. Yeah. That'd be a perfect little plane for up my place. Yeah. Did you, did you fly up the river? Yeah, I yeah. went up the river. How was it? It was nice. Yeah? Yeah. I just wanted to go for a little flight there. It's like, uh, well, I, it's, I have my license and I never, I never, you get, never get to fly. Home. So, so this is Mark Andre. He's from the North Shore. Yeah. He, he's Cam got an accent because he's French, so sorry about <laughs> that. He, nobody's perfect. It's fine, though. <laughs> yeah, sorry about my accent. <laughs> Uh, anyway, he you got your pilot's license, what, last year? Oh, uh, it was May. It was May, it was, so yeah, this year of May. Yeah. You've done a couple of flights since then? Yeah, yeah. Uh, but then it's just been, what, six months since That's you've it. been here? Five, six months, yeah. So I uh, came back and we we did a flight in the 150, then he just went up and did a solo flight in the 150 just to kind of fly around again. And um, anyway, he wanted to try out the 701, so here we are. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad I did. <laughs> it's uh, it's a different animal for yeah. sure. Oh yeah. You can see what I mean about it being more like a jeep though than a car. Yeah. Like the doors are really thin. Yep. Like you can feel air come in a little okay, bit yeah, here yeah. and there. Like it's not the 150 is more comfortable. Yep. It's a little quieter. It's just it's nicer. And but it can't land on an island if you that's want it thing, to. Which yeah. We could go up and land on this island if you want to. That's depending yeah, on that's, what the winds that's, are like. Let's do that. Yeah. That's the island where you uh, broke my landing gear. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's that type of flying that got me into aviation anyway. Right. Trent yeah. Palmer and the, all that the stuff. The so. stuff. Yeah. That's what I like too. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm a I'm an off road kind of guy. I don't like I don't like staying on the beaten path. Like it's it, it got me discover that side of like aviation, like Cessnas and like yeah. I mean uh, certified airplane and all that. Well, that's that's it's how cool, you, but that's how you train, right? Yeah. You got You got to train somehow. Yeah, so you train it. in the certified stuff, but yeah. then then you can experiment and get into the more yep. interesting plane yeah, later. Yeah. Where's your horn? <laughs> nice. So that's the uh, beach there. It might be all right. It's looking like the water came up a little bit, though. I'm not sure if it's going to be long enough. Oh. I think it's usually. I think it's usually longer. Yeah, it's usually t almost twice that length. But we'll go down and look at it. I'm gonna do a slip, don't freak out.
Nice. <laughs> Seem to be enough space. Good enough, yeah? <laughs> yeah, this is the shortest it's been. You're, you're gonna get me, uh, want one of those. Gonna get you, uh, excited about one of yeah, these, eh? Yeah, yeah. You, you can see I probably didn't need to be on the brakes as hard as I was. I well, kind of skidded a little bit there, but I wanted to make sure we stopped yeah. before we got to the end. <laughs> Understandable, I guess. Yeah, yeah. So many cool spots that I could, that you could land up. Exactly, place. yeah. Alright, ready to take off then. Unless you wanted to get out and skip some rocks. <laughs> <laughs> ready? Yeah. The acceleration, the torque, like you said there. Yeah. Put you back in your seat for sure. It, it, in the Cessna, you're like, am I, am I full power? Am I going? <laughs> and it's the same horsepower. It's crazy, It's eh? 100 horsepower for this, 100 horsepower for the 150. And what's the weight of this? Well, I see, that's the difference. That's the difference. The, eh? This is uh, 600 pounds empty. Wow. So the 150... 600 pounds? 600 pounds empty. Wow. The 150 is 1,100. Yeah, that's... Oh, well, okay. So that's one reason why you get better acceleration. Yeah. So other than it being a stick, it'll feel a little different, but at least it's the correct hand for you. So you have control. There's your throttle there if you want it. Okay, it's still, uh, that's quite different there. Yeah. It's sensitive. It's very sensitive. And it feels different. Yeah. You, can, you can tell it's lighter there. Yeah. Turn this way. Sure. I like it. Fun, <laughs> isn't it? It almost feels easier to fly than the. It's really light, right? Like it doesn't that's, take any that's, effort. Yeah. Like I, I thought the stick was were, was going to be like more loose. You know like what I mean? Like you, you barely move it. Yeah. I miss that, man. <laughs> Six months was too long. Yeah, no kidding. But the only the only reason why I, I could I could wait six months is because I got the sim there. The sim was good. So yeah, tell the yeah, tell the, tell them about your what what you do on flight sim or on on Twitch. So yeah, I uh, I started the channel on Twitch. My my name is the VFR pilot. So if you that's are... the VFR pilot. I'll translate, Casey. <laughs> And yeah, so I don't have any schedule, anything yet there. I'm just streaming for fun, but I'm streaming pretty much every morning. I wake up, yeah, I wake up and I drink my coffee and I do a little flight. And and you do it VR, right? Yeah, I'm always so, in VR. So yeah. when people are watching, they see what yeah. you see whenever you look around. Yeah. And do you talk at the same time? Like, hey, well, well I'm doing this, I'm going here, I'm yeah, looking a little at this bit. over here. I have, um, I have a, like an application that because I can't, I can't see my chat, right? Right. In VR. Right, of course. But I have a... It's, I think it's just a website, actually. It's called Speech Chat. Okay. So it, it reads... Oh, whenever there's a chat out, comes yeah. in, it says it to you, so yeah. you can respond. Yeah. Oh, that's really neat. The only thing is, it's... If I said it in English, and then somebody in French writes something, and it's like, what, 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 what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, what? what was that? I don't know what that was. <laughs> but yeah. Other than that, uh, VR, man, it's... Is the way to go yeah. for flight sim. I or think, any sim, actually. My, I don't think my computer would handle it. I've only got a gaming laptop, not an yeah. actual desktop, but someday. But yeah, someday for sure, yeah. yeah. With a yoke and uh, yeah. rudder pedals and all yeah. that. It'd be very immersive, huh? All right, I have control. Yep. Little clearing turn here. I like this window up here so I can see oh, above. That's as the well. do, yeah. Just be able to see through the roof. Yeah. 
Isn't there a Cessna with like... There are some Cessnas that have skylights in them, yeah. So this is slow flight in the Zenith. Jeez. <laughs> Faster by my foot. Like, I'm actually climbing still. I gotta bring the power back so I don't climb. So there's 20. <laughs> and over the ground, we're doing 21. Oh, there's zero on this one. Nice. And that's because the pitot tube is at such an angle, right? That's all that is. The air just can't get into oh, it. We're not actually going. Mean, yeah. the worst, we're actually going 20 still. Yeah, we're not moving much. We're not moving. So there, there's the stall. You kind of feel that? Okay, yeah. Like, and it's not even that bad. So there, I'll make it stall. Like that? Like, there. <laughs> nothing. Nothing like the Cessna at all. Isn't it crazy? Yeah, I'm starting to like that plane. Well, we should go over and see Dave. You haven't been to Dave's before, have you? No. Just the video. Uh, just a video. Uh, you the, you made Dave's the scene, airstrip the scenery. <laughs> from, from on from flight videos, camps. and you did it from you haven't even actually seen it in real life, but we should totally go see it. So yeah, if you're on flight sim, so with Microsoft flight sim, you can custom make scenery, and he custom made all the little airstrips in this area. He did Dave's airstrip, Tim's airstrip, Woodstock Airport, and Jake's airstrip out in Juniper. Yeah. So if you fly flight sim and you're in this area, you should totally go download that. Um, just search for Woodstock Airport on yeah. uh, flightsim.to. Yeah, that's yeah. it. And also, you have to use the Google Maps scenery yeah. if you want it to look good. Yeah, you don't have might, to. It might look weird You don't there. have to, but it looks weird without the Google the Google scenery. So the VFR pilot is also your yeah. flightsim.to username. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. That wind is pretty strong, that wind is pretty strong. We should be able to get down in there without any problem, because it's right down the runway. So I think we'll give it a shot. Because why yeah. not? Yeah, yeah. We're also allowed to land in this field straight ahead of us if we wanted to. Like after the after the strip? Or? No, I'm just saying like we're allowed to. Like if, if for whatever reason I had to land oh, yeah, here yeah. or date, like he doesn't own it, but he knows the guy who okay. does. And the guy's like, yeah, you can land in there anytime you want that it's cut. And to land like feels like that, all you need is permission, that's it? Yep. And you don't even need permission in New Brunswick. We have uh, a trespassing law set up so that if it's not posted, it's implied that you have permission. Okay, 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 I know what you Like hunting, it's the hunting rules, right? Oh yeah. Not even hard. That's his wife. That's his hangar with a boat in it. Oh, nice. Might as well get out and say hi to Dave. Sure. Ready to go? Let's go. Let's go. Was it you telling me that the uh like Woodstock Airport before, wasn't it like close to the river and the river it was right down there? Okay, it's close to yeah. here. There's that, the well, those two little islands you yeah. are, are connected underwater as one big long island. Okay. And that's where the airport used to be. Oh, yeah. And then the Mactaquack Dam went in 
And this is all this is all flood water from the Matchquack Dam still. And so they flooded it out, so they moved it up here. Okay. Let's talk traffic, Mike Echo Mike, downwind, 3 1, full stop, which stop. And that was no flaps too, that was just a regular landing because of the wind. Wow. When, when it's really windy and gusty, I don't normally do flaps for yeah. landing. Does it make a difference though? The flaps? Less, less Huge there. Oh, in terms of bumpy? No. It's just when you get really slow, if you get a gust, you can stall easy. Oh, okay. Right? Okay. So the, the less flaps you have, the faster okay. you want to be. So if you get a gust, you're, you're farther you're away from your through, stall. Through the gust right. Yeah. So that's off, that's off, that's off, and it's off. Alright, say bye Marc-Andre. Bye Marc-Andre. There you go. Nice.